Good morning, Sunrisers. I'm Dr. Jansen, and today I have with me our head tech, Katie, and this here is Mike. And Mike actually came to us. He was found um, by one of our good clients, um, and they had noticed that his eye was really, really nasty infected. Um, and it was bulging out of his head just a little bit, and the eye itself was very abnormal. So we opted to do what we call an enucleation procedure, where we actually go in and we remove that eye. And in Mike's case, he was already non-visual in that eye. He definitely couldn't see for how long we don't know because again they had found him um, but a lot of times when we do these enucleation procedures like this nine times out of ten they actually feel better after surgery because they don't have that super super painful eye um, sitting right there in their head and we it's a very simple procedure we go in we take the eye out we put a little layer of suture um, he did have to wear the cone of shame um, which is kind of hard for cats to do um, but uh, he, he did fantastic with it we took his sutures out about 10 days later and as you can see it, it doesn't even phase him Mike's a, a otherwise happy healthy playful kitten um, he is still making his way through his kitten shots currently um, but he, he handled it just like a champ. And like I said, a lot of times these guys, they just feel better. I mean, you know, surgery may be a little bit painful and you have that incisional pain, but in all honesty, the pressure from that eye and any pain um, that that eye may be causing actually gets relieved. And there's several different reasons why we may opt to do enucleations. Um, sometimes it's trauma or a damaged eye. Um, we can do them um, if the pressure gets too high in the eye, so glaucoma, um, which we see a lot in older dogs and that can actually lead to their retina which is the part that processes vision can get detached um, and then again they're not visual in that eye so if you think your pet maybe has something go with the eye they're squinty maybe the eye is bulging out or it's really red maybe they're rubbing their face or have excessive tears give us a call let us take a look you know we try not to jump to surgery unless we have to but in Mike's case it was definitely the right decision but give us a call I promise your pets will thank you WCBI Animal Health with Dr. Emerson was brought to you by Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point.